everybody, this is Boomy Moore, your personal coach and vice chairman, marketing director, soon to be, with FDI Longevity today, talking to you about building a large list. I want you to hear me clearly. Your list is your raw materials for doing business. If you do not have a list, then you are really not even, you haven't even begun to start doing the business. So how do you build yourself a, a large list? Okay, your list is your raw materials. So the way that you start day one in business is by making a list of everybody that you know, everybody that you've come in contact with. Yes, I still promote put down your friends and family. Yes, still put down even people who you think may not be interested. Just get all the names out of your head, out of your cell phone, and put them down on paper. <clears throat> You can always go back later and prioritize and see who you're going to call first, who's most qualified and all that. But start by putting everybody down. Your list is a living, breathing organism and it never stops. The goal is to keep it growing. So when you first sit down, you may come up with a list of 100 people. You're using the memory jogger. Who do you know that's in real estate? Who do you know that's an accountant? Who do you know that got married last year? Who do you know that has a lot of hustle up in them who likes to try stuff. You no, know, so the memory jogger, where if you were to sit down without the memory jogger, you may come up with 25 names. With the memory jogger, you probably will quadruple that number and come up with at least 100. Now, you should always be building your list. How do you build your list? Simply with the people that you meet. And you have to be intentional about building this list. So maybe you go to networking events in your city. Maybe you, you know, prospect while you're out at the grocery store. Maybe you use social media and Facebook. Maybe you use video marketing and you drive people to you. But every new person that you meet needs to go down on your list. Because when you sit down to do business, you need to have people to call on. When you're building a network marketing organization, 80% of your time should be in prospecting peaking the interest of people for who may be looking for an opportunity. So, here is my prospect list. I have everything in the composition notebook. I've worn it to pieces. I'm about to restart the list. But as you can see, hopefully you can see, you know, I've numbered it and I've got plenty of names and numbers all throughout this book. I mean, I'm up to over a thousand people here in this composition notebook. So do the same thing. This is what I tell my team. Get yourself a composition notebook. Get the names out of your phone and on the paper. So right there, you probably have 200, 200 names. And then always be adding to it. When you're out meeting people, give them your card. Ask for theirs. Come home. Put that name and number down on your list. And I'm telling you, your list is going to make you or break you in this business. Because the number one thing you got to do, folks, is you got to have people to talk to. You got to first find people to talk to, then talk to the people that you find. And once you do that, you collect the decision. So be intentional about creating a really large list. He who has the biggest list wins, but not just having the list, he who works the biggest list wins. This is Boomy Moore, and I hope that's been a great tip for you. I want you to schedule your sponsoring time and get into that prospect list.